Hey guys, free pick time. All right, back again with another free play. It has been a few days since I got a free play out to you guys. We come into this with a record of 114 wins, 72 losses. So rock and roll for the year. We did take a loss on our last one, guys. This goes back to Sunday. Um, Vegas and the Chargers, we had over 52. Uh, they got a lot of red zone opportunities, just couldn't seem to get touchdowns. And by the time they finally did get some touchdowns, um, pretty much too late. Uh, it's too bad. I really did like that one. But um, overall, guys, our football so far has been lights out. Uh, picked up a couple winners on Monday. I would 2-0 or 3-0? 2-0. No. I don't know. I have to double check. Anyways, we won on Monday. Um, yesterday, huge day. We went 15-4 and four yesterday. As a matter of fact, just going back over a bunch of plays, over our last 650 plays, that's a good volume, okay? Our last 650 plays... We're hitting 60%. So very, very strong. Um, yeah, busy card again today, guys. If you're interested in full card, benderwins.com. It's $99 a month. Gets you my full card every single day. And we just got lots of baseball going on today. That's, I think, what everything going on in the world, right? Just baseball today and uh, lots of value out there. So um, let's get it. Uh, what are we doing? Baseball, obviously. I uh, have another first half play for you guys. I had a few... Um, first five inning plays today that I gave out. Uh, this is one I like. I'm going to walk you guys through the math here on this one. So we're unfortunately, and it pains me to do this, really does, because I'm a big Blue Jays fan, okay? I'm a diehard Jays fan. Um, this is a major, major series for them, okay? They need to beat Tampa and vice versa. Tampa needs to beat Toronto. So I'm wholeheartedly going to be cheering for Toronto, um, but we don't bet with our hearts. No, we don't. We bet with our minds and with math. And the math is telling me take Tampa Bay plus half a run, first five innings. Now we gotta pay minus 145 on this one. Don't mind, okay, here's the breakdown. Tampa Bay is gonna win the first half 44% of the time. Toronto, 37%. That leaves us with a 19% tie. But since we're getting half a run, that 19% of the time where we have a tie means we win, right? So when we add the 44% that we believe Tampa's gonna win with the 19% tie, that gives us a win total, expected win rate of 63%. That means the true line should be minus 170, not minus 145, meaning we have 25 points of value. Now, last thing we wanna do guys is scrutinize and we wanna add a 3% MOE or margin of error. So if we add a 3% margin of error and say it's not gonna win 63, Ryan was wrong, it's only gonna win 60%. Well, that line is minus 150, and that's okay because we still have a pinch of value. Even if it was break even at minus 150, that'd be okay once you factor in the MOE. Benderwins.com for the full card, guys. Best of luck.